What's up, everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We are back here on Forza Horizon 4 in a st basically street tuned E46 with a wide body. So we are here today just to have a little snow fun because the snow season is upon us now. And we are on snow tires, so I'm not sure if I should be changing this off snow tires, but I think uh, snow tires might be too grippy. You would think they wouldn't be it would be a good choice to have on the car in the snow, but might be too grippy for what I want to do. There is some guy in this car park up here, so we may go see if we uh, what he's doing over there. So winter season is upon us here in Forza Horizon 4. It is nice to be back behind the wheel of the sim rig. It's been a minute for sure. Been doing a lot of uh, torque drift and stuff like that. I cut that too short. Yeah, I don't know if uh, Snow Terrors is the right choice for me right now. But we are going to go check out this man's leaving. Every time I come into the parking lot when somebody's there, they decide to leave. It's sad because, you know, I kind of just want to rip my way into the parking lot and try and maybe get some random tandems. But we are going to rip ourselves in here. Like I said, we're just here having a little snow fun on the wheel. And, uh... Just uh, doing some uh, snow sliding. I think snow tires might be too grippy for what I'm trying to do. So we probably should have put uh, not snow tires on it because, uh, yeah, it's actually uh, really grippy, surprisingly. It's uh, kind of hard to uh, break traction, which is surprising with a rear wheel drive car in the snow. But we are trying. We probably should have kept our normal tires on it because uh, these studded snows I thought would still give me enough slide, but they seem to uh, they seem to not give me enough slide. So we're gonna switch those tires real quick. All right, so now we have uh, street tires on, so the car should uh, have a little bit more slide to it. Yep, there we go. That's a little bit more slide like I wanted. So, what I want to know is, what is your guys' winter choice of car? Because, uh, I know a lot of people are switching to uh, all-wheel drive cars and stuff like that because it is the winter season. What is your winter choice for a car? Now, uh, whether it be drift car or normal driving car, I do prefer my 22B Subaru that I use in the snow season, but uh, I figured I wanted to bring this pretty much stock. It's about a little over 400 horsepower. It's got intake, exhaust, and uh, some uh, injectors and stuff. But otherwise, this car is just how uh, pretty much a stock car. It does have a rear diff and uh, a clutch as well as the wide body and drift suspension, obviously. So we are here today just to have some fun in the snow because it is a winter season now. So there is a section that... Uh, my teammate Urgent and good friend decided to uh, show me last winter season and uh, I tried it when it was summer season in the game but I uh, totally forgot to bring it to the channel but it's this nice little like back road section that is kind of fun to just uh, slide around in and it kind of loops itself around so it's kind of cool. So it's kind of a section that you would find in real life that you might be uh, wanting to just uh, rip, except for that snowplow, don't hit that, or you'll rip yourself. Like if you found this road, like in real life, you would probably send it in a rear wheel drive car if there was nobody around, or if it was just your friends, to have a little fun on it. See, I'm actually surprised that it's not sliding more than uh, it is. I thought it would be kind of uncontrollable, but uh, I don't want to hit that car. I'm trying to do this uh, legit style, I'm trying to wreck, but I thought it would slide more. That's a snow plow. Ugh, don't hit the plow. That plow uh, kind of. Hey, oh, I guess I'm supposed to go on the other side of the arrow. So, like I said, what is your favorite snow? Uh, no car to drive in the winter season on Forza Horizon 4 if you play it. If you guys are catching the glimpse, the fact that I'm in it, why well, bought E46? 
probably because you guys came to the Torture stream know that I'm going to probably be building a replica of my uh, Pro E46 here in Horizon 4. Don't hit the snowplow. Try and drift around the snowplow. Excuse me. And uh, this is the start of it because the Y body is here as well as the rims are somewhere. I just got to find them. But this is uh, the start of it. Trying to just uh, have a little snow fun. That's a really long e-brake grab. So like I said, this car doesn't slide as much as I thought it would. So, and I figured it might slide a lot more. So we may switch up cars to have a little more snow fun. But this section is actually uh, a lot of fun to drive. Especially if you've got a friend and you uh, are throwing tandems. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, so I feel like we're gonna switch it up to a uh, little first person mode and have a little like actual, uh, if we were on this road in IRL. So I do enjoy driving in first person. I do enjoy, enjoy drifting in first person as well. I don't do it as much on the streams or channel because it's not as, uh, what is that viewer uh, viewer friendly to see in first person than it is in third because you can see more in third person than you can in first so that's uh, I know a lot of people go why am I in third person on a wheel that's why so we are in first person right now I'm gonna try and uh, do some slides I'm actually surprised at how much you can rip this car actually has. That man just went flying. It's kind of weird because he's using paddles because his E46 is a uh, automatic E46 in the game. Whoops. We just caught the snow broom. I'm sure there's some other fun snow roads that we could hit. Is this, what's this guy doing here? Just hanging out? Luckily, he's a ghost, so he can't uh, hurt me too bad. Uh, it was a big thing that happened in Horizon 3. A lot of uh, people will be drifting, and people just run in and just start ramming you. So I think we're going to flip this back the other way and go the other way. So I may bring out one of my other drift cars that has a little bit more power. I feel will slide a little bit more than this one will. Because this is just the the start of the E46. Because uh, we're going to be doing a full E46 build on this. So, what other drift cars do I have that have a decent amount of power? Oh, old man drift car. 616 horsepower. Old BMW. I'll take it. Forza Edition BMW, set with drift suspension, and uh, I believe a turbo and all that. So this should be fun. Old M5. Yep, that has a lot more wheel spin than that E46 does. But we're just going to kind of nonchalantly cruise this car and see if we can't just have some fun with it. Trying to think which way I want to go. Strutting on some gold uh, HRE wheels. Yeah, see this car has a lot more power, so a lot more slidiness. And uh, all I gotta do is really clutch kick it just to catch it out. The snow is a lot of fun to drive as long as you don't get tagged by a snow plow. I find the snow pretty fun to drive in the game. I did love Blizzard Mountain and Horizon 3, and uh, the fact that we get some season changing in Horizon 4 is definitely a lot of fun. I'm trying Manji through these cars. I hit the brakes, hoping I could kick that back with just the weight, but I probably uh, should have pulled the handbrake because I understeered a little bit. Not only do I drift on torque drift, I drift here too. 
Obviously, if you guys have been a member of the channel for a very long time, you guys know drifting is a big part of this channel. So I think we're gonna try and see what uh, season events we have for this year. Or this year, this season, I should say, because I know there are seasonal events, and I want to find out where they are. And I want to find out what everybody's doing. I actually don't see seasonal events. Slightly confused. Oh, there's one. Ah, uh, there's the another one. That's actually right down the street from us. So, we're gonna uh, drive our way down there, see what seasonal events and what we can win. I do have some wheel spins that I will probably be doing as well exit. before we end the episode off here today. Hope you guys are enjoying yards. the week. Turn it is Friday. Thank gosh. It is the weekend. It's gonna be a lot of fun coming up here. This weekend, I have some friends coming over, having a little get together. That dude just sailed. I feel like he is uh, trying to get the danger zone, and I'm over here just plowing the streets with this uh, M5. So I am very curious, like I said in the beginning of the episode, what is your favorite winter car to drive? And uh, is it rear wheel drive? Is it all wheel drive? What a uh, drivetrain is it? I do love my 22B as well as my R34. Um, they are nice all-wheel drive cars to drive in the snow. But I do also enjoy uh, some uh, nice high-speed snow drifting and some nice snow drifting for sure. So I'm very curious what cars that this uh, championship is going to make us use in the snow. You slide a lot in the snow. I love the grip changes between each season. So, clutch in, there we go. Oh, wrong button. So let's see what we got for the seasonal event. Uh, we can re-win first place, but it's highly skilled. We can win the Vox Carlton. And then we can win an alien morph suit. 90s collector. All right, so we got 90s collection. That's going to be uh, interesting. Going to definitely want to do that for the Vox. And then we have the other one, which is down the way, which we will not look into right now. We'll look into that one for another episode because we are going to be on winter for a while. Seasonal danger sign. All right. So it is kind of cool that they give us all this stuff. So everybody's up there. I wonder what's going on. Oh. Forces on just ended. So I think we're going to pop our wheel spins real quick and uh, see what we can get on our wheel spins. And um, hopefully we can pull some good. We got nine plus regular and a super. So we'll save the super for last. I say nine plus, we have 14 wheel spins. So definitely going to hopefully get some good stuff on the wheel spins. I wanted that R33. I don't know why I wanted that R33, but I did. And I think we'll take that lows. I do see a Forza Edition car there. I feel like these wheel spins are kind of broken. And I'll take 110 grand. I'm up to 4.6 million. I know that's not a lot. There's some people that have a lot more than I do. But it's good for me to have a good amount of money. I want the car underneath that. I wanted the, the one underneath that. I don't really want the Morgan. I'm never going to use the Morgan. But I think I might bring out the Morgan and drift it in the snow. We can do that, but we always need, you know, some uh, some yellow pants. Ugh, so many clothing options in this game. And floral shoes, floral trainers. Yeah, because I'm going to rock some floral trainers. I feel like I should change my outfit for the winter because I am just rocking a keep calm and clutch kick wife beater. Old school Porsche. So wheel spins are kind of failing me today. And we're not really getting anything good. I would have taken that ZR1, but no, I'll take, you know, money instead, I guess. So we do have a Jeep Renegade. It's kind of a cool grab. I guess I could drive that in the winter. Do some Jeep stuff. Go mountain climbing. What do we got now? What are you? Oh, 300 R2000 Lotus. That's a fun little car. I'm excited actually to grab that one. I know it's kind of a normal car, but I'm kind of excited to get that one. What do we got next? Camo pants. 
Yep, not gonna wear some camel cargos. So we got four more wheel spins and then a super wheel spin left. Hopefully we can get a good pull. Legendary yellow biker's gloves. Well, I mean, I guess I wear them for like driving gloves in the game, so I can switch them out between blue and yellow if I really want to. 97 Civic Type R. Hmm. I don't know if I'm ever going to use a 97 Civic Type R. I might know somebody that'll want a 97 Civic Type R, though. But that right there. The Malone shirt. Water Malone shirt. Oh, boy. Forza. You give us more outfits and stuff, but, you know, you haven't given us anything really good in the wheel spins. 35,000. We got one final wheel spin, then one super wheel spin to end this episode off. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode. A little snow drifting, a little fun in the snow season, getting back to the full, full Forza content all next week. So look forward for that as well as some live streams. We did get another SUV. So we're going to finish this off with a super. And hopefully we'll get something good. I don't want another BMW. I already have one, but I guess I could sell it if I get it and make some money back. Jaguar F-Type and 10 grand. Not a very good pull at all. So let's see. We could probably pull out that little Lotus, do some donuts real quick. And uh, that would pretty much be it because uh, I don't feel like this is gonna drift very well because it won't have an angle kit. But uh, we're gonna give it a shot. So like I said, make sure you guys follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram, all which are found in the description box below. This is not a good car to be in the snow with. Because it's all open, nice and cold. And it probably... Oh yeah, there's no, no angle at all. So I think that's going to do it here for this episode here on Forza Horizon 4. Hope you guys come back next week for the full list of content. Hopefully, we'll be bringing Game of Drift back to the channel here on Forza Horizon 4 with the team. So look forward to that coming to the channel. If you guys remember Game of Drift, it was a lot of fun. Hopefully, we'll be doing Game of Drift this week with the team or some of the team to uh, get Game of Drift back on the channel and then be bringing more games of Drift with you guys as subscribers to the channel as well. But at least now we get to drive on the lake. Now that the lake is frozen, we get to uh, do some... Uh, really awesome sliding and some really insane J turns so as always I thank you guys for coming back I like thank you guys for watching and appreciate all the support so until next time I'm evil rabbit I'm out oh, I want something